Tonight at 10, the opioid epidemic is taking over the Wolverine state. According to the state, since 2000, opioid deaths have grown tenfold in Michigan. These deaths are causing families, communities, and Michiganders all to hurt. According to officials, it has become one of the biggest health epidemics in the last several decades. Thankfully, more help is on the way after Governor Gretchen Whitmer makes a big investment to combat the issue. CW50's Chris Walker shows us how treatment centers will benefit to help save lives. More is being done to fight opioid abuse disorder in Michigan. Governor Gretchen Whitmer signed a package of legislation this month to invest $800 million in opioid treatment, prevention, and mental health. Fawn's Amanda Scott from the Detroit Recovery Project says will go a long way. Preventing before there had to be legal consequences involved, which is also a major cost to the individual and the community. So it's by doing some of these things, we're also preventing some of the costs on our community and allowing us to have more money to circle back around and focus on those services too. According to a report conducted by the Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Administration, heroin use is up by 196% amongst black and brown communities, while prescription opioids saw a 140% increase. This could be someone whose insurance isn't covering their pain meds that they very much need. Um, and as a result, they're going to the black market to get their their needs met. And because these pills are pressed to look exactly like the prescription, uh, you wouldn't really know that you're getting something different than what you would get from your pharmacist. Governor Whitmer stated in a press release the legislation will be instrumental in preventing more deaths. So you're taking a pill and, and it is either a lot of fentanyl or, you know, they're not the same. You might have a batch of pills that had, and each pill has a little bit more or a little bit less fentanyl. Uh, so someone else might take a Vicodin from a Vicodin from that same batch and be fine, whereas someone else might pass away. The Michigan Overdose Data to Action Board shows there were 2,804 overdose deaths in 2021 alone in the state. Reporting in Detroit, Chris Walker, CW15 News at 10.